Okay guys, I don't know what's happened, but I think the Arctic wave has arrived. Like it is so freaking cold out here. And it's so windy, like extremely windy. I went in Dollar Tree and it was kind of cold. Came out and it was like, you come out and your hands are like numb. Anyways, I got a Dollar Tree haul. So I went to get some more ornaments for our tree. She kind of just shoved this crap together, which is not cool. But anyway, so the first one that I have here is Santa Claus, and he's super cute. He looks like this. I was checking his nose to see if it was okay. Isn't that pretty, his little beard? So I got that one. They didn't have a whole lot to choose from. Like They were really picked out. And then I got this little reindeer. One of my favorite ones, or actually the, my favorite one out of all of these, I'll show you in a minute. Got these little Christmas trees with stars and a bell on here. <clears throat> and then I got this little jingle bell. It's got burlap and two little pine cones on it. Isn't that cute? I should have got another one, but I didn't. But this one's my favorite. It's a little Christmas or the church. Oh, some of the stuff's off of it. Dang. Oh well. But isn't that cute? See, it's kind of, some of the stuff came off. Oh well. So I got those. I want to put these in my hallway. Um, that's not doing any good running that right now. But I'm going to put these in my hallway. I just couldn't let these go. They're just super cute and I love the encouraging words. So, um, anyways, this one says... Trust in the Lord and don't be afraid. So in my hallway, I'm just going to kind of put them all in one line. Like, not in a line, but kind of, you know, like going downhill a little bit. I'm not really good at um, decorating, but I just, <clears throat> I just do very simple, simple stuff. Because I've never been one to decorate. Um... But it's okay. I'm happy with it. And then I got this one here. This one says, The joy of the Lord is my strength. We all need to be reminded of this daily. So, I'm like, you know, I love this. And that wall is bare in there. Well, kind of. I have some stuff in there, but I just thought these were cute. And then this one says, I'm starving to death. I'm going to have to hurry and get off here and go get me something to eat. This one says, the Lord looks at the heart. Everybody's getting ready for Christmas. Almost all the Christmas stuff was gone. But I found, guys, I found a lot of good stuff. Just saying. I came, I hadn't been to here doing an Oak Ridge in forever, so I figured today I'd come out here real quick. Oh, crap. I've got to get some wraps for my snake, or for Isaiah's snake, too, while I'm thinking about it. So, I'm going to let the kids decorate the tree the rest of the way. Uh, <clears throat> actually, I'll probably, let the, I'll probably let the boys because the girls done the first half. So, the boys can do that. And then I had to get some uh, stockings because the ones that we used to have, I can't find. Um, I went and got the Christmas tree, but I could not find the stockings for what we had last year. Which sucked because those were cute um, stockings. But anyways, um, I got these. These ones are the girls. I still hadn't got me one yet. So I got those. These are real pretty. It's like a burlap material. Like kind of. So I got those. And I got this. These two, these two were for the boys. This says it's the most wonderful time of the year. They had like cartoon designs and stuff like that but my kids are getting old older so i've just done it like this 
And then this one says, have a holly jolly Christmas, which is super festive. Got those. And then I couldn't resist this because, guys, this is just super cute, okay? Like, I'm not even playing. I should have got one more. There was only two of them. But it's a freaking wine bottle bag, and it is burlap. And it says, believe in the magic of Christmas. How stinking cute is this going to be with a bottle of wine for someone? So, I got that. And then I got, where's the other freaking box? Oh, here it is. I got, <clears throat> guys, I don't care how old you are. I love to color. Me and my mom used to color all the time. I need to start back. I stopped doing it for a long time just because after she passed, I just didn't color because it reminded me of her so much. But I got my kids some crayons along with a coloring book because I remember every year getting uh, getting crayons and a coloring book. You just can't go wrong with that. Like, it's the best thing ever. And, you know, sometimes kids need to steal away from the internet, need to steal away from their phone, need to steal away from TV, and just be a kid in color. Just saying, okay? So, I got them that. And then I got some of this. This just look, it looked interesting. It's um, ribbon candy. It says it's spun into a delicious, thin, delicate treat. We cannot guarantee this product against breakage. Handle with care. Guys, I love some freaking peppermint, okay? So, I got those. I think I've seen this before, but I never got it. So, this time I did. So, oh man. I don't have anything to hang these up with. I'll figure it out tonight. So, I got up this morning and realized my air was not like it, it wasn't running like it, like I left it. I had it on like 71 last night. Woke up this morning freezing. Justice had turned it down because he was burning up and it was set like on 40 something. I'm like, really? So, I jacked that crap up. I'm like, no. Son, we are freezing. And anyway, so I got up got the heat going i made all of the kids some hot chocolate with a little peppermint stick which was super phenomenal because i ended up having a cup too which was great and then um i made me a cup of coffee and put a peppermint stick in it and then after when the kids left i made me a cup of hot chocolate and put like i had about this much chocolate left or um, coffee and then where the peppermint stick melted it was real like pepperminty like so i made a small cup of hot chocolate and it was perfect it was just divine. I sat there, drank it. I watched Santa Claus is Coming to Town and some Christmas movies. I, well, one Christmas movie. So, I got these. I couldn't resist this either. This is the Hot Cocoa Candy Canes, and it's the Brax brand. I got those. This is probably not enough candy canes, but it'll be for now. And then I got the Cold Stone, um, just to make it colorful a little bit. And this has mint, mint, mint chocolate chip. And then our strawberry blonde and birthday cake remix. So, heck yeah. Which I'm sure by Christmas gets here, these will be, oh God, these will be all gone. So, <clears throat> got those. I was walking by the socks. <coughs> I couldn't resist these two. Music notes. Aren't those just darling? Look at that. Like, this is just so me. I could not resist not to get those. And then some margaritas. And some martinis. And I don't know what sauce on here. But guys, I had to get those cocktail socks. They're just phenomenal. Got them. And then I got the girls some of these uh, expressions. Express yourselfs. Little headbands. Head wraps. And they have little jewels. Well, not jewels, but they have this on them. This brown one don't have anything. And then this red one has stars. This one's super cute. And then the white has that, the same thing. So I got them those. I got, they had the whole selection of these. I was going to get it, but. I really don't need all of them. So, every time I see any kind of lip glosses, I try to get the whole collection because I'm a huge lip gloss girl. But, I ha I'm having to save my money a little bit. So, I just got one. This this one's the watermelon. 
So I have the watermelon one and then I have the mint one. They have a grape, they have a grape one, a vanilla one, and a strawberry one, I think. I think that's all of them. And then these are new. These have little glitter in them. They're super cute. This one is a Christmas tree fragrance diffuser. They have a pomegranate one. They have a, a cinnamon spice one. And then they have another one, but I got the Christmas tree. Got this to put out. But y'all can't see it, I don't think. But look, it's got glitter in it. Isn't that pretty? Shimmering, glittery. So festive. And then they had a green apple one, but I put it back. I just got one. Um, every time I see these and it's a either a brand that I haven't tried or a brand that I like, I pick up them because you never can go wrong having a back stash of wax melts. Like I have a whole stash. Like my stash is declining, but I keep it up. I keep getting some stuff when I can. Oh my gosh, this reminds me of summer and spring. It reminds me of my mamaw's house. All of the honeysuckles that used to be out and stuff. But this is the coral, the coral honeysuckle. And my jaw's sore. I don't know what I've done to it. <clears throat> All of these lifts, lifts and stuff at work are continuously bending and like you, I'm clumsy with like myself. So I'm either like the floors at work have like little tid, tidbits like because the facility's old and you can be walking and you trip and almost fall. I've done that multiple times. And then like on lifts, when I raise up, I hit my hip. I hit my, I've, I've even hit the side of my face before because you kind of like raise up and you get busy and I'm like, ouch. So, I want a turkey at, this guy's laughing at me because he's seen me reviewing my stuff. But I want a turkey at, um, I should have waved at him. I want a turkey at work. A huge turkey. The daggum thing's like this big. So, I'm thinking about, well, I'm going to cook it tomorrow. I've never cooked a turkey by myself. Ever. So, I don't know what I need to do to it. I'm going to Google it and see. Um, and I want to get some cornbread to make some like stuffing like or cornbread and make some turkey dressing that would be so good i want to make uh turkey dressing macaroni and cheese um mashed potatoes and rolls and cranberry sauce and corn for the kids and deviled eggs that's what i want to make so hopefully i can make that tomorrow after work so i got this it says it's got six bags so i got lucky and won that turkey I'm gonna cook it and then I'm gonna get some freezer bags, like what me and the kids don't eat, and I'm just gonna freeze it and make like turkey salad and turkey sandwiches and stuff like that. Cause I'm sure it'll be a lot. So I got the, this is the coloring books I got the kids. These are the Bible Fun um, color, Colortivity. Colortivity. Um, this one's Power in His Name. And so I got one of the boys, one of these. It's got like different stuff that they can do. The Lord is my refuge. You are my hiding place. You will protect me from trouble. <clears throat> but it's got pictures and Bible verses. I remember getting these when I was a little kid. The Lord is perfect love. Whoever does not love does not know God because God is love. That's a perfect thing to remember, guys. Love always. Love your enemies. I love you guys. Love each and every one of you. So there's just different ones. I got that one. Uh, this child of the king. This one's going to be Isaiah's, and the other one's going to be Justice's. The Lord is the Lord is our one true hope. See, there we go. Every time this word hope has been put in front of me for two weeks now. Even for a son who has left home and lost his way, the Lord offers hope. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. Plans, plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and a good future. Jeremiah 29, 11. Isn't that awesome? So, I need to keep that there because I'm going to... So, I got that. And then for the girls, I got Challenging Color by Numbers. And I'm probably going to give Gracie this one. And then Katie's going to get the Ultimate Dot to Dots, Connect the Dots and Color. These are cool. Like... It'll give you something to do if you're bored or, you know, but they're dot to dots. 
I used to love doing stuff like this when I was little. So that's that. <clears throat> well, let's do this one first. So all of those products that everybody's been hauling, I found some last week and this week I scored. I finally found the coconut cream. How do you pronounce this? Barilio? Valerio? I don't know. So I don't even want to even try anymore. But anyways, it's the exfoliating moisturizing coconut cream and vanilla. Body scrub with coffee powder. This blend of coconut cream and vanilla scrubs away dry, flaky skin, leaving you feeling soft, smooth, and supple. Your skin will take on a new moisturized glow with a toxin-free radiance that makes you feel completely rejuvenated and relaxed. So, I got this one. These are the ones I've been looking for and finally found them. So, I got that one and I got the cranberry and sweet orange. And then I got, they had the coconut cream and vanilla gentle face scrub in the tub, but they didn't have the other one. <clears throat> I got, I couldn't remember if I got the cranberry and sweet orange or the coconut one. I'm bad about remembering. But I got the girls one each. So I'm going to use this one and put in our room or our bathroom, mine in the girls' bathroom, and just put that in there for us. But this one's the cranberry and sweet orange. I'm pretty sure this is the one that I don't have. So I got us those. And then the girls, some of these cranberry and sweet orange bath fizzers. And then the coconut cream and vanilla. So I almost got them a whole set for Christmas for that. I'm going to try these um, Febreze Freshness Hawaii, Hawaiian uh, Aloha trash bags. This, These are the um, the tie ones. They don't have like the little bag that, or the, the part you tie or whatever. But I'm going to try these. There's seven in here. Give those a whirl, kids. And then, um, Breezy Floral, um, what do you call these things? Fabrics, sheets. Oh, somebody, uh, commented on my YouTube about, um, they took an offense for me to call them kids. Guys, that's just who I am, and that's just how I talk, so... Um, if it offends you, I do apologize, but it ain't meaning to be offensive. It's just my personality and <clears throat> what do I say? Anyways, let's see here. I can't remember who, who put that on my, on my comments, but I was like, really? So they had these, they had a whole big old selection, but it was just one kind. This is the Swanson's soup mix and it's the chicken tortilla. All you got to add is chicken and diced tomatoes and chicken broth. Um, so it looks like this. I got the diced tomatoes. I don't know where they're at. And then I got some of this San Francisco sourdough bread. This just looks good with the bologna, sand, not bologna, but ham or turkey or um, what is that roast beef? But I guess bologna would be good too. I don't have any of them, so I'd have to get some, but... I just thought, or even like grilled cheese or something with soup. Heck yeah. Y'all can tell that I'm starving, right? And so, guys, oh my lord. Yesterday at work, I took a bag of these, which I only ate two of them and gave a couple of friends one at work. The Russell Stover Strawberry Cream. What's going on? People's alarms are going off. If y'all see these and you're at your Dollar Tree, this has a white freaking fudge around the cream filled strawberry candy. It's amazing. Like, it's just phenomenal. Like, y'all need this. Pick you a bag up. You can't go wrong. You'll find it in the candy selection with all the chocolate. I love this. It's awesome. And there was only one of these bags out. Every one of the other ones were gone. This is the peppermint crushed peppermint pieces in white fudge omg i can't wait watch this will be good with either hot chocolate or coffee one of the two so this stuff is going to be hidden far away because i can only eat a piece or two a day that's it and then this just looked so divine and caught my eye so good 
Like, I'm not even playing. This is the Russell Stover Coconut Bites in smooth dark chocolate. So, I got those. So, I want to do, like, not this. My kids go back Thursday, but maybe when they come back, if I have the money. I want to do, like, a, like a movie night at the house and do, like, um, little snacks and do little crafts and stuff with them. So, I'm planning on doing that sometime when I get it all gathered up. So, there's that. What else do we have? Oh, so, I need to put that there. Um, believe it or not, this detergent, I ran, I ran out of my game. I normally do game, but I ran out of it, and my money's kind of been on a pinch here, here lately. So, this stuff right here, I'm telling you, it works really good. It works super good. It's, I mean, it's just as, just about as good as like a name brand product, but it's the totally, or the LA's totally awesome two-in-one laundry detergent plus fabric soft softener, and it's the fresh scent, and it's got 32 loads. They have an orange one that I want to try, but I know this one works really good. The orange smells really good, but I was afraid to try it, so I'm going to do this one, and then when I come back and have the money, I'm going to get the orange one. Because these are good. And I ran out of my last cup full today. Because I've got to wash some clothes when I get back. <clears throat> so I got that. And this this stuff here, the Swallowtail, works really good too. Like it smells so, so good. I love it. Oh my gosh. This one's the lavender. The soothing, soothing lavender. I know this has fabric softener but I always add more because it makes your clothes smell real good and then I got the this is for the soup the taco soup this has the garlic by roasted diced tomatoes and then guys the last thing that I got here oopsie I hope this is big enough but I got a turkey pan and I got some toilet paper and I got some of these they had these are new it's the extra large size dog pads, like the bigger ones. So there's four in here, so I got those. So anyways, guys, that is my DT haul. Hope everybody's having a great day. I've got to go get me something to eat. I'm like super starving to death. I think I'm gonna go to this Chinese food, Chinese restaurant up here. And then when I get home, I'm gonna see what the kids want to eat and see where they want to go. Anyways, I'm gonna get off here. Hope I hope everybody's having a blessed day. And um, stay blessed. Remember the Lord loves you. Remember to take one day at a time. And to remember never lose hope. And remember to always trust in the Lord. He's our only true hope in this life. And anyways, I love you guys. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.